The technology behind solar power has now evolved to become a viable leader in renewable energy. Not only is it now profitable, but it's also one of the most powerful tools towards our goal of a net zero future. And Solar X Power, normally known for its power systems in homes and businesses, has been driving the charge into new areas. At this leading motorsports company in Worcestershire, they design, build and race cars in championships both in the UK and around the world. And here in such a carbon intensive sport, they're actively looking for ways to reduce their footprint, not just in the technology they use, but also in the facilities where they work. Quite some time ago we started on a mission to become more energy efficient and we realised we just need to make a change and start contributing to the bigger picture and playing our part. First of all we started off with a 50 kilowatt solar array, so that's around 260 panels on the roof and, and they generate in excess of 40 kilowatts all day every day in good weather. And I suppose we then started thinking well we're not using all of that, it's going back to the grid. So we started thinking well how do we harness that? The solution was battery storage. These inverters and batteries from SolarX Power capture the excess energy generated by the solar panels and stores it on site for use whenever it's needed. And by doing so, it reduces the need for feed-in power from the grid at other times. A win-win for both the company and the environment. It's definitely a win for our commercial and uh, domestic users who at the end of every quarter will look at their utility bills and see considerable savings. And it's a win for the environment simply because the technology that we offer allows the clean green energy to be stored in the batteries and used even when the sun's not shining. And that's obviously going to play a big part in our, our aim to reducing our carbon footprint and achieving our climate change goals. And keeping track of the energy generation and storage on site is made all the easier by having online tools and a phone app to monitor real-time data and savings. That's where we're winning and this is our a little tentative footsteps into it. We plan to increase the storage as we go forward. Now we understand it and now we're getting used to it. So we're really seeing benefits from absolutely day one of installing it. It was remarkable. Here, energy bills have been slashed in half since the batteries were installed, but the technology can also save money for customers who don't have solar panels by giving them flexibility in when they buy and use electricity. If the end user doesn't have uh, solar panels, it's still possible to draw energy from the grid at a time when energy is particularly cheap. Overnight, for example, energy can be very, very cheap or even in some cases free. That energy falls into the batteries, which effectively is a reservoir of energy. And that energy then can be drawn on throughout the day when prices are typically much, much higher. The drivers will have to decide when to deploy that electric power. Next year, there are plans to race hybrid cars assembled here. It's all part of the desire for greener solutions in the workshop, which also make good business sense. Ultimately, everything we do to this building adds an asset value in, because I believe as we move forwards, people will look to buy premises, whether commercial or residential, that have some good, solid green credentials about them, which A, save them money, and B, help reduce their carbon footprint. With battery technology, solar makes sense. It's not only profitable for business, but a powerful tool in the fight against climate change.